This is going to be a roller coaster. I don't know what this video is actually about, but it's been recommended for me to watch a lot, and Akashot does make great videos. So, Genshin's first impact. I'm going to try not to pause too much, but I'll probably still pause anyway, so let's just get into it. We'll just get in. Is this the boys? It is. I love the boys. What is this? Is this like all the 1.0 stuff? Genshin's first impact. Looking back with the not so fond memories. Oh god, the flashbang loading screen. What? Is, is Somewhere in MiHoYo headquarters, <laughs> I was so a Chinese businessman is tasked with a job of making more money. Klee Banner sold pretty well, so why don't we take this and make another child terrorist? And just like that, ladies and gentlemen, just like that, version 1.1 started off with four new characters. Wow, okay, we're getting right into this. You know this. I grow restless when life is ordinary and boring. We're getting right Though in. Though in Fine, I guess you are my little pog champ. Tartag. That's not what he said. Also, the OST for Tartag is Bola, and the character demo slapped, dude. It was great. The second child terrorist, Diona. The bar owner hires Diona because she's cute. Interesting. You know, I would check Monsat laws for child labor, but I realize she's a cat. There ain't no laws for cats. Zhang Li. Isn't that? Zhang Zhang. Xin Yen, whom today I learned shared the same VA as Barbara. What yep. can you take from this? Xin Yen is Southern Barbara. True, Me she is. Howdy, partner. When I call Tartaglia the second child terrorist, you might think it's Klee. Yeah. Are you here for playtime with Klee? It is Klee. There's no way it's anyone else. No! You got him? And the other him. As a veteran oh. <laughs> player, I don't even farm this domain anymore. He doesn't do anything. You just kill him in three hits. So out of respect, I won't beat up children anymore. But there was a time where his difficulty was lore accurate in the Archon quest. Dude, I wish I got to experience this boss fight at its prime when it was actually difficult before they nerfed it. But I never got to experience that. You had to go through Tartaglia. But instead of being everyone's bitch in the story, dude mm -hmm. was basically Tartaglia New Game Plus. Yeah, I thought it was really difficult. I too shall use all of mine. This guy just cut my head off with one move. <laughs> and party wow. level 35. Really? Party level 35, my balls. Wait, that level 80 ca- But he's level 71 here though. <laughs> That's different. Surely. Wow. Oh, no, you're already dead. You don't get to eat. No, you're already dead. Surely, right? You're dead? You run out of stamina. Yeah. Damn, dude. Oh, my God. Now, show me what you can do against the He does so much. Oh, yeah, I guess no NRE either. You couldn't eat in the fight. Ooh. Uh-oh. Wow! What the dog? I'm doing. What the dog doing? Do you guys think they just didn't scale him as a boss and scaled him as a playable character? So he's using four piece noblesse with a decent ish crit ratio, and he just deals normal damage that you would deal to a hillishall. What the dog? But to your characters. What the dog doing? What the dog doing? That might be it. Oh my god. Holy shit. That's insane. What dude. would happen if all men die? Get good. It's just a boss fight. Yeah, but it's not a boss fight. Nice. It's not a boss all you can eat. The devs saw how only five people cleared this fight and eight. Five people? Days later, he got nerfed in the story. The lore accurate Tartaglia that we know and love was found dead in a ditch right behind. There's no shot only five people beat that fight. You was one of them? There's, there's no shot only five. He's joking, right? The golden house. I'm sorry. Hey, buddy. Hold still. Apparently all five are in my chat. <laughs> this move went from Wonder <laughs> After the nerfs? Oh now my it's God. like, you know you love me. I know you can't. <laughs> <laughs> it's 
didn't even do that. And I'll be there. A touch of frost. Why is he just stuck there? I'm gonna get copyrighted. What? Oh yeah, it just doesn't do anything. Decrease the difficulty. Oh no. I saw this. I think I laughed at this on the You Laugh and Lose. Hey, look, guys. This Tartaglia boss is so easy. 79.9% of travelers killed him on their first try. But what about pre-nerf Tartaglia? I said 79.9% <laughs> of travelers killed him on their first try. You guys yeah. remember the very first leak to ever exist? You know, the one with Zhongli kicking the spear and everyone was like, Oh my god! Jesus. What a beast! Unreconciled star... I'm trying to. I know Akron. I don't think I know anyone else here. What a beast! Unreconciled. Wait, was that Lakari's voice? I thought it might be Lakari. What a beast! Unreconciled stars. Some dude sprinkled Shungite all over <laughs> Tebat and is killing everyone. The meteorites seem to harbor a strange power. A power that sends any who touch them into a deep sea. Oh. I never got to do that. Escaramouche, the hat guy. Hi. Can you do the fandango? <laughs> Hi. Sounds interesting. Mind if I join you? Was that his voice? <laughs> Sounds interesting. Mind if I join you? Why does he sound? Like a Veggie Tail character. Mind if I join you? You can see this came to be what? the first rock type event. Collect rocks, kill monsters, collect rocks while killing monsters. If the reward from Elemental Crucible was like a slice of pizza, Unreconciled Stars, it's like nine pizzas. Holy Peasants shit. became king this patch. Literally. Thank you, Scaramouche. Thank you for your customer service. It's a shame he kidnapped Fischl and held her hostage behind a ransom, but at least you- Is it? Get her for free. This would be my first official for the next two years. Damn. Well, they don't call her the Princess and Div uh, Luchalung for nothing. Catherine, vassal of the Imanachai, rejoice. Oh, God. For to join the Princess and Div Ertelung on her majestic mission, I. Official von Luftschloss Nofedor, divine protection of one's Edelstein der Dunkelheit. Why couldn't he have succeeded in kidnapping her, dude? I'm just saying, like, I, listen, Fischl's great. She's great. She's fine. But god fucking damn. You dare to parrot the parlance of the princessing for the princessin de Ertelung? Do you mean to say there are others who have fallen into a similar slumber? Yes, a golden one slumber. One has witnessed with one's own Og de Ertelung. <laughs> I am Fischl von Luftschloss Nofedot, princessin de Ertelung. Princessin de Ertelung? Apparently. I hail from a distant and long lost land known as the Imanachai. And long lost land known as the what? Known as the Imanachai. The in my what? Right? <laughs> Remember when I said Unreconciled Stars was like nine pizzas? Well, you actually play as a pizza delivery man for this event. Wait, this was the good one. Well, the really bad one, apparently. But I want to do this event. I want to do that event. I really do. Uh... Hey, I ordered a pepperoni pizza a minute ago, and I was wondering what happened to it. Sorry oh, about no. that. I'm currently climbing Mount Everest to deliver your pepperoni. Every order you took had some troll-ass requirement. Like the person ordering doesn't want their food to be wet, but he's under a waterfall! <laughs> I'm surprised that Wang Shu in delivers this far out. So is everybody else. Hey, look at this guy over here. He ordered a slice of bread and the Avengers. Oh my I have God. to get through the fucking Avengers to deliver your one slice of bread. Oh, what's that? Dude, you this is climb, insane. Sprint, climb? Hey, I was wondering where my chicken noodle soup was. Just give me a moment for I am currently being gunned down in the middle of the street. You guys remember when the Volin was totally broken? <laughs> The Bluetooth, Wait, I this guy was the buggiest shit ever, and he's oh. not even a bug.
When you pass what? the speed limit and you no clip into his ass, oh. when you pass the climbing speed limit and you teleport back down. What? Yo, I, Venti! This I feel edible like, ain't shit. I feel like that's happened to me. But what the fuck? I feel like that's happened to me where you use your burst on top and you uh, you teleport back to the bottom. Yo, Venti! <sighs> this edible ain't shit. Wait, what? <laughs> Jesus. That's insane. That is insane. That's a bug! That's a bug! That is a bug! This is why you don't I have say. to fight Andreas. At least he has no bugs. This was truly back when we had important discussions like which teleporter was the fastest to Andreas. But then they added uh, portable waypoints in the game. So, so why would you go shit. to any of these when you can teleport straight in it? Yep. <gasps> oh! People often associate touching oh grass as a sign of mental wellness, but they never specify if it had to be in real life grass. The grass in Genshin at this time was killing people in game oh, yeah. in real the life. Pyro damage. characters were basically unusable in the overworld because everywhere they go, their <laughs> skills would start burning the grass. For yeah. some reason, 1.0 grass was bugged. It wasn't scaling with your world. What's the worst that could happen from fixing the grass? Whoa, dude, this is totally fire, man. Yeah, they eventually damage nerfed attack. the damage Holy. next patch, but for 1.1, the grass was hot. How to remove grass in Genshin Impact? No ban, no grass, Genshin Impact 2.0 fix last. No shot. This, this has to just be turn your graphics down so it doesn't show up, but it's still technically fucking there, right? I get boost F. P.S. This oh is why God. you never fix the grass. It just kills people. You see, 1.1 felt like if 1.0 had an update. We had some of the greatest changes. Well, that is what time. happened. Resin cap increase from 120 to 1. When is this going to happen again, please? And 60. And they never changed it ever again. Yeah. Condensed resin, also known as I don't want to play, but I'll log in to avoid capping. Characters dispatched on expeditions are no longer <laughs> oh, out yeah. of action. They were stuck First in the mines. All, why would you be out of action for 12 carrots? You can lock artifacts and weapons. Just like how I'm currently locked inside the back of a car. They finally added the blue archive in Genshin. Oh no. The crying emoji seems to be what's keeping us together here in the chat. Sadly, you can see everything except for how many hours you have. What? On a second thought, Diona being a cat, All I play Sikros time? being a dog, Chong Yun Chong and out. You can now feed, feed dogs, the dog. but you can't pet what? them. You can now feed the dog. You can't pet him. Uh -oh. And can we talk about how hyped this trailer was for its time? No. Diwa was once a peaceful place for boats, but now. Oh shit! Get me out of here! I was having That's a nice sick. sandwich. All of a sudden, there's just this hentai monster. You piece of shit! Bring out the Chinese Avengers. Guys, I'm gonna need some help. He needs our milk. America? How to build a house. Oh, a Genshin guide. Greetings, Trailblazers! Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome to the Genshin version 1 Build a Bear Workshop. Today, we're gonna be building Shang Ling. <laughs> the best way Jesus to go about Christ. building her is going straight up attack. If you can get as much attack as possible, just put it on her. I just gotta say, I'm in love with the Crescent Pike right now. I love Physical that it does what it does. It's gonna scale with my character as I build her up or future spear users. Do keep in mind that Shangling is not to be played for just to drop her skills and switch out. She has great damage capabilities and should remain on the field when your other characters are rotating through their skills. <laughs> hey guys, I'm back with a new video. So in today's video, I'm gonna be talking about Jiang Ling. If you guys don't know, Jiang Ling is a f pyro character so yeah. obviously you're not gonna get <laughs> Zhang Ling is a f pyro a f pyro character. character what was he gonna so say obviously you're not gonna get Physical. every single stat possible so the main two stats you want is for the base stat you want attack so on the fire first two, i think it was gonna be physical not fire you cannot get attack so the first one no actually the first artifact is HP, then the second one is attack. So she's a pyro uh -huh. character. That's why I'm in this pyro flamey area. The reason we're going with Chi Chi here 
is because Chi Chi works very well with Faisal to support Zhongling. So on the Faisal. last three, you want to get attack percentage. If you can, you want to get Faisal that attack percentage. Uh, now, for the substats, if you can get attack... 41, 41, <laughs> 41 at the bottom. On top of the attacks we had at the top. And again, this is going to scale so well. She's level 60. There's no way even then that was classed as good, right? No shot. Bonjour à toutes et à tous et bienvenue sur cette nouvelle vidéo. Celle-ci par exemple pique du croissant. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Further Beyond Gaming. My name is Cody GT and in today's video, this time around, I wanted to do a bit of a character breakdown for nice. my girl Jay Ling. Uh -huh, uh -huh. The main stat, of course, I want is base attack as long as i have base attack then i can work with it so this crescent pike is insane like it does a ton of damage <laughs> once insane. you get this leveled up once you get your artifacts ready to go you build her for a ton of attack percent you don't have to build elemental attack on her you just have to build a whole bunch of attack with these two builds <laughs> shaolin's four star weapons of choice can be the prototype grudge the main reason is as i mentioned earlier shaolin is not a character that you use just for her skills with shaolin's normal attacks she is one of the fastest attacking characters in the game and with few ways to boost attack speed currently this makes her normal attack absolutely no fucking shot <sighs> TLDR, nobody knew what the fuck they were doing. You don't say, yeah, that's incredible. It's a very good source of DPS. Incredible. I'm gonna give you tips on how to use Zhang Ling. You should use them for hit stun. Text is Gova. Gova's gonna be the majority of your. She's a very good attacker for, uh, let's say, 1v1 situations. In, in group situations, it's a little more tougher because she does kind of puts her feet down but that's this is where her charge attack comes into play no, um, this dude. is really a good <laughs> charge attack i don't use it too often she's for me on field she's fantastic on field often but it is good to um reduce the distance um to go ahead and get closer in range with the enemies spear users dash <laughs> coming out in the future which is Zhao which is the one we've seen from the story and we've already seen Zhongli coming out this is going to be a great item to invest in because for them they may be your normal attacker you know you may be wanting to normal attack with them and I think this item will withstand the test of time her power needle I love it man I love it I love it oh my god <laughs> like you guys don't know I'm a huge fan of it and you get it so quickly the power needle no you don't <laughs> and you get it so quickly the power needle that's how you can build her up uh definitely go attack attack attack, attack. <laughs> Same build attack 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 because you get pyronado so quickly. I'm dead. Attack. If you want to build a crit, you can, but I'd say attack, she definitely go insane. She is way outdated for where I am. I'm like world level four right now. If she was up to date, you guys would see mad numbers. I got another Shangling build. This time I like to run him with Wolves Tombstone. <laughs> oh my god, it's not Shangling and it's not a tombstone. My setup is usually what a uh, pyro damage sands. My setup is usually what a uh, pyro damage. Oh, that's the joke. Okay, Jesus fuck. I was about to say there's no way anybody was serious with that. And that was Akasha, I think, right? <laughs> fuck, dude. This video's an emotional Do you know roller the story coaster. Of Durin in this mountain. Hot diggity dog. This place is magnificent. Monster was so Dragon good, Spine. they got a DLC, Dragon Spine. Yep. This region actually makes sense. At no point in my Monstad journey did I ever find the Monstad. My disappointment is what? immeasurable. I'm at the harbor of one of the most prosperous trading hubs. Where's the Liwa? 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 Sing Chu? Dragon Spine on the- What is bro yapping about? Akashot, brother. Other hand? Oh. You actually find the oh. dragon spine. We oh, did for it, guys. fuck's sake. We That's... found the dragon spine. This you place was magical. <laughs> That's a we got cage. snow. We got boars. We got more oculi to farm. We got new enemies. Oh, I God. have no enemies. It was such a nice change from the green plains and the orange mountains that we were so used to. Everything in dragon spine was out to kill you. Sure. I remember the first time I saw a ruin guard. I thought it was a ruin guard. Oh, you know, it's gonna do that hand clap thing or the spin move. And then uh -huh. just... You got the classic <laughs> places like Albedo's camp, the Entome City, the caverns. Yeah, the I nails, love Dragon Spine so much. Bones. Give me, give me, give me some 
it has a little bit of blue for everyone and the underground they were dangerous but they were never overwhelming <laughs> yeah. I, don't know I was picking up cheeto dust on mount everest cheeto, Do Christmas. This wall statue shit. The tablets. Secret rooms. I did that fucking difficult puzzle by accident, I think, that you had to light up on the wall. I think I just brute forced it. Yeah, no problem. It was a fun time. Get it was. Except this one. Bro, this is the one I was talking about the other day, chat. Oh my god, this is the one where the fucking abyss mages and shit spawn and you, you go in the water all the time and you get the fucking biting cold shea cold and you freeze and you die underwater. This was tough. This was actually a difficult challenge when you were first leveling up and stuff. It was hard. If you know, you know. Yep. It was so annoying. <laughs> Dragon Spine doesn't just look cold. Your characters will actually feel the cold. Sheer cold was never that bad. But I wish it was around up. for the oh, release man, of it. Ten ways to prevent coldness in Dragon Spine. Yeah, Number yeah, one, kill your guys. Love yourself. That's all I gotta say. You should love yourself now. The yeah. music. The music's beautiful. What the fuck? Hello? Hello? Is he okay? How are you? I am under the water. Please help me. Goodbye, friend. Oh, look at Zhao. Where's Zhongli? Oh, poor dog. Peter Parker. Ken? That looked like Ken from the Barbie movie. Is it? Or is it fucking Joel from... I'm so confused. It is him? Okay. For a soundtrack that's meant to be very soothing and warms the heart, yes. this is the shit you hear when you're freezing to death. And for that, I give Dragon Spine the coldest soundtrack in the game. True! I it was is cold. An idiot back then. I tried to pyro the ice off the teleporter. That's not that idiotic. That is understandable, and I think it makes actually a lot of sense. The amount of times that I died from freezing to death outside the artifact domain. That's a skill issue. It's too many. There was a. I mean, it has a torch right there. This is one place where you see these frozen boars. What the boar doing? Oh, nothing much. Protected except that mom. one time it stampeded over a child. You can feed the foxes. Yes. What? You can feed the foxes? And you get shit for it too. This is for Bitch. You were like a grandpa airship into some snowy mountain. What is going on? The whole Damn. area is just breathtaking. That's why it's number 15 in Genshin's most breathtaking locations. Dragon Spine. 15? That's gotta be like now, right? 15th now, not back then. To me, it was a fun little pit stop. I found the lore interesting enough not to skip. The free shit was annoying, but it never disrupted my exploration. Grow up. And I'm not gonna but lie, unlocking the nail at the top of cool everything. Fuck. So cool. All purpose. It really made me feel like I was in the dragon spine. The yep. summit of dragon spine is peak exploration. That is a factually correct statement. I, I literally cannot be wrong. Oh, no, I agree. I agree. Oh. You like the way it sounds, 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 sounds. I can get enough. The Chalk Prince was what I like to call the DLC to Dragon Spine, which is also a DLC to Mondstadt. Yeah. The DDLC. Just like Unreconciled <laughs> Stars, you kill monsters while collecting rocks and cash out in the it, shop. Yeah. Sadly, no one kidnapped Fisho and locked her behind a ransom, so you might not get her for free, but God we got the it. festering desire instead. Which never fucking came back. You're welcome. No, I won't explain what it does. Look it up. Towards the end of the event, there was this flower boss. What kind of lame-ass whopper flower looking at- Say what you want, but I genuinely could not kill this guy solo. Really? Was it tough? Oh, shit. <laughs> At least with Crucible or Unreconciled, you got your run-of-the-mill Bob Burger Hilly Churl. Oh my god. Yes, well, I am someone who couldn't give a rat's ass about co-op content in this game. 
I like co-op content. I prefer the lone wolf method of gaming, but this whopper flower was kicking my ass. So Five I minutes? the canines in a collaborative effort to subjugate my skill issue. There were phases where you had to block its one billion damage move and seeing your team all huddle up on oh, no, the shit thing. out of this stupid flower a minute later? It really festered my desire. Nice. The story in Chalk Prince was so homogeneous with Albedo that when you search up gameplay of the event, you often see it lumped with Albedo's story quest. And honestly, it might as well be a permanent side story. It's kind of hilarious as well because the second event also felt like Albedo's story quest. And honestly, Albedo's story quest did not feel like Albedo's fucking story quest. Almo. Genius. New players had to be there when Reckless Pallid killed Sucrose. Okay, he didn't. <laughs> People act like he fucking killed Sucrose. I've fallen and I, I can't, can't get, get up. up. And not only that, he went for round two. <laughs> let's talk about me. Let's talk about you. Let's talk about the Prince of 1.2. Albedo's first banner yep. was a heist because the four stars stole the spotlight. You had people fearing for their lives. If it's gold, I walk into traffic blindfold. If he huh? wasn't already six foot deep in the grave, Ganyu walked over and built a house. No, she's not a support. She's a bow character. Then why does she have an RPG? For a character that had cryo amber allegations I mean, before I her release, Ganyu eventually became a top tier DPS. If Ganyu is a cryo amber, Yoimiya is the pyro amber. No, she's it's really not. a matter of preference, you know? Some people love her charge no, shot gameplay not. and others wish they could charge shot themselves in real life with how boring it is if cryo why hot i'm telling you there is no mortal human being on this plane of existence that can resist those chicken drumstick legs it is impossible we have the huh? most tagged genshin character and a guy who creates life Albedo is literally Life Weaver Overwatch 2. My platform is here. I mean, okay, yeah, I guess with the skills he is, he is, he is. I remember coming when Life Weaver was coming out and I was like, interesting. Very he interesting. He is Life Weaver Overwatch 2. Gone you. Gone you. I'm gonna say it. Gone you has some of the best demo music. And I don't care what anyone says. I think she did. When there wasn't as many characters out. Now? Nah. It's not one of the best, in my opinion. She definitely used it all. She, she was one of the best of the OG characters. It's not very good. I just don't think it's one of the best. None of you would skip it? Yeah, no one's saying it's bad though. People would just say they don't think it's the best. Bad she take? Is literally I don't think that is a bad take. I think it's an opinion. It's a goat! Get it? Because she's literally a goat! Just look at True. Ganyu's demo. Why is she sleeping in the middle of nowhere? Police? 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 Look at her. What is this scoundrel uh, doing sleezing around these three brutes? Someone oh pick God. her up. And then look at him. He just not turned the butterfly into a chicken? A That's chicken? not a chicken. Marvelous <laughs> merchandise. Let's be honest. It's the girl of your dreams, but you're uh, stuck with the Dollar Tree version that is the it. monthly web check-in. We also got a True. quick face for ascending characters. Nothing too special. Just a quick influx of like a hundred pulls. Piss what? silly. Piss silly. Let's talk about Piss the <laughs> January 8th. 2021 incident oh no what was this if you go back in time you see a shit ton of people addressing the resin problem genshin impacts 1.1 resin change will not solve the problem at all this game has a resin problem math inside the resin changes are not enough genshin impact rant why does resin even exist? Oh come on! This was a, this was an actual tangible argument at the time because it's a fucking gacha game. Dude. Remember last patch? I said they never <clears throat> changed the resin ever again. This is a true statement. But on January eighth, inside a Chinese PlayStation, there was a five dollar resin pass for an extra forty resin per day. If you were someone who was unsatisfied with the resin system for how per much? day. How much? If you were someone 
who was unsatisfied with the resin system. Mihoyo solution. Five dollars. So basically a Welkin moon, but for resin, forty resin a day. I'd buy that. <laughs> hey, buy this five dollar resin. I ain't even gonna cap. I'd buy that. <laughs> five dollars for, for twelve sixty resin. Some players see this as a five dollar investment. Others see this as five dollars to get fucked. Depending. On I already spend my fucking primos on refreshing. Why wouldn't I buy that? On who you are, we never saw it ever again. The pass got removed the same day it appeared. Damn. What? Why? Why did it get removed? We'll never know. But one thing I know for sure is that we don't need more people flexing their artifacts. Fuck you <laughs> and your 40 CV looking ass. <laughs> I guess. Man, I can't fucking sleep. What is that noise? Uh, is moaning? That's it. Hello. Good. Lament. Shall. Hey, can you keep Evil it Evil cock ring. Evil what? Get out of my way. Ew. I'm coming. <laughs> hey, Shao. Version 31? Zhongli, Tartaglia, Ganyu, Albedo. Get these frauds out of here. We only care about Shao. Oh. That wasn't any of Artaglia, the Tartaglia, Ganyu, Albedo. Get these frauds out of here. We only care about Shao. Oh, yeah, that's right. Do the Shao thing. Holy Lament. shit. Oh, my God. Shao. Oh! Come on, man. Don't be that way. We all got our demons. Do you ever look True. at someone and wonder what is going on inside their head? Yes. If you were an early shell farmer, farming artifacts for this guy really made you feel like your shell. Fucking shit. You have to farm a two piece viridescent, but the game's like, hey, man, what's up? You've been farming for Shao? Two piece VV? Oh, well, yeah, two piece. Isn't Shao a pretty lonely guy? But I think he said four piece for some reason. And a lonely guy needs more maidens, right? He Lol. needs more maidens. Once you're done with the ass blast viridescent domain, whoop de doo, jackass, you need two piece gladiator. What's that? Yep. They only drop from bosses, so it's actually two times more expensive resin. Oh, I guess they didn't have the strong box back here, did Boys? they? Thank you, Shao. Thank you for the 706 no cryo stones. Pain. What? Suffering. Why do I even live? Who am I? Who? Tao. Dude, she must have broken the game when she Quick, came out. Holy. Something. Did you know who Tao's Japanese voice actress voiced prominent anime characters like Megumin from Konosuma? Hey, everyone. So, earlier Hi. today... Oh, it was I the... saw someone post about this 300 thread, this 300 tweet thread, but there's one, there's one dude talking about who Tao. Yeah, I saw this. Oh god. Not the fucking Dark Souls music, dude. This is Dark Souls, I think. Taurus TV music. Maybe. Every new character seems to be bringing something cool to the table. Yep. So, when will he be joining the game? Xiao will be available through his very <laughs> own character event wish. Ciao. Sometimes, I forget that Kaching had a banner. Damn true! I wasn't here for this, but... Come on, man! What you doing pulling on the on the Kachin banner? It's a free-to-play bait. No, True. You, you can't be pulling on this banner. It's a bait. It's a trap. I mean, if she was already on trap. standard, then yeah, I don't know. Number five, I stole. Despite what nostalgia wants you to believe, the first oh. lantern right is forever immortalized as a Liwa festival without any Liwa characters. I can't say what? this word, man. Shit. Besides Xiao. None of the cast ever showed up. They all just died on this seemingly important day. What? Let's go, baby! Lantern right! <laughs> it's time to do the lanterning! Let's go! What the fuck? How's Shen Yan, how's the hand? I've never actually seen what the first lantern right Man, was. get out of my way, bro! This I've place is so the trailer. <laughs> ka -ching, what you doing up there? She's not. <laughs> now, isn't this lively? Go moon gazing with Kaching. She died in a car accident 10 years ago. You oh have to let God. it go, man. You That's a fail. Oh, 
Beto, please! Give my sister back! No, I mean, ka -ching. It is I, the magical crystal albedo ball. Ask and you shall receive. Sucrose. Okay, now I'm confused. We need to cook. Am I taking a make a ka -ching? No. No! No! It is I, Ketching. <laughs> The real catching that died 10 years ago summoned to go moon gazing in a dead music. lantern right festival with the traveler. Instead, you were running around doing fetch quests. It really made you feel like you're in a festival. Yeah. If you were the staff slaving away. Young traveler. Bro, I'm not being funny. That's 90% of fucking Genshin events nowadays anyway. You always feel like a worker at whatever event it is. This girl wants one Qingxin. Go and pick Qingxin flowers from atop the summit. No. Nah. Why do I need to go to the summit? I have a hundred. I said, go and pick. So here I am uh. climbing Krakatoa for one flower that I have a million of. What's her problem? Two thousand years oh, later. No. <laughs> nice. There it is. <laughs> it's fresh. <laughs> This one is a fresh ching shit. Got the paddock on my wrist, doing fun flares, giving you my number, but it's all gone. Oh Not again. How many more mountains will I have to climb? Oh. Oh. This guy just wants the shitty ching shins. No That's what shot. I'm That's why he's hitting me! That's why he's the goat! I don't mind NPCs, but when you're throwing 20. 26 NPC world quests. 28. You've gone too far. I'm here to enjoy the festival. In one land, I'm right? Why am I Bro, fixing what? your dog shit boat? Help me take this picture. No problem, iron ingot. Lantern right. <laughs> More like lantern I need rights because so everyone good. was using me to run their <laughs> errands. Fuck. What am I, some kind of dog? The requirements for unlocking got that dog these fetch quests is literally called city of chores. <laughs> Even the game's calling this shit out. We could. You might as well just call it corporate slavery at this point. But I've enjoyed Shen Yen's concert with Zhang Li. He would like it. Her music rocks. Helped Beta with her bow. Nice. Not this guy's boat. Never again. Cooked with <laughs> Chang Ling. Arranged marriage with Ka Ching. There was so much potential here. Come on, you Damn. can do better. There was a lot of What's potential that? for Lantern Right number they gave one. gave us a four star selector and 10 intertwined fates. Take everything I just said back. Theater Mechanicus <laughs> was one of my favorite events added to the game. I had so much fun running around. I'm gonna keep it a buck. No other Theater Mechanicus has ever come close to this one. And this is the same one that they had when I played. And then they updated it to become the fucking slime minigame where you control the fucking fungi. And uh, it's never been the same since. Just killing hilly trails and building walls. Nothing stops There's the, the wall. The one event that, that just got worse and worse. Freeze was absolutely busted. Build a house of cryo towers, go Barba, and you just insta win. It was a nice. good mode to chill and have fun. Yeah. From Wrench Wang and his shitty boat. You had these mystic arts. There was an upgrade system for towers. You yep. could strategize with placements. Get the only thing that could make it better is being able to make your own maps and let people do it in like co-op and stuff. Tower That'd be fun. Gets my approval. The end of Lantern Rite, despite the fetch quest. Video's not in 240p, it's in 1080. It got me a little bit emotional when the Bambi start flying. This scene of Xiao staring at the festival alone because his Sundari ass can't be caught in his fields around the traveler. Yeah. He's just like me. A lone wolf. 1.1, <laughs> you feed the dog. 1.2, you feed the fox. 1.3, you feed, you feed Xiao. the Xiao. But don't forget, Lantern Rite also had a web event. Light five lanterns and win a billion primo gems. It's a real shame you don't get the whole billion, but at least it's split for all travelers. So when Christmas came and everyone got Wait. their primo gems, no fucking shot that was a real title, right? Was- was- No. That- that wasn't- Wait, it was? They actually said this? <laughs> wow. At least it's split for all travelers. So when Christmas came, and everyone got their primo gems from this web event, word got around that not everybody got the same amount. It was discovered that the primo gem rewards was- No. It's RNG between 108, 188, and 288. The highest RNG prize was one wish.
Wow. That's insane. I find it funny that you get more Primo Gems doing nothing waiting for maintenance than a web event where you have to remind yourself to do five times. I didn't give a shit about the difference in Primo Gems, but I got 108. <laughs> I will not be silenced. Okay. What if the Romans won the siege of Constantinople in 1453? How often do you think about the Roman Empire? Well, what if I also won 288 Primo Gem? Imagine going to work and your boss goes, it brings me great pain to announce that from now on, salaries are now distributed through RNG. What? LOL? That's a Welkin. I'd do that. But then again, that's fucking 50,000 We got the first ley line overflow. Huge what am I, event. some kind of poor person? There was this commission event where they gave you primo gems. What? <laughs> Don't remind me. Don't remind me. <laughs> Don't do it. Don't do it. Kaching. What? what do you think of this patch so that far? That was a th What? Don't remind me. They should add that. <laughs> Don't do it! Don't do it! Kaching, what do you think of this patch so far? This patch had so much variety with the events, from having an updated universe to our That's favorite, <laughs> Animo Boy, Shi Ao. It really made me appreciate the love and care me ho you'll put into their games, I mean, come on. 180 resin to 240, Don't. double drops, free 10 pulls. Name a better gacha game. I can't wait for the Trailblazer to reunite with his sister next patch. Remove this part of the message when pacing. Whoa, 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 whoa. The money has been sent business. to your account. Did you know that the Battle Pass never gave Fragile Resin, but it was actually 1.3 that started it? You know what else 1.3 also started? Events not requiring resin. That, fu that Bro, that fucking blows my mind that they waited until 1.3 to stop charging resin for events. Crazy. <laughs> Zhongli buffs are live. I repeat, Zhongli buffs are live in 1.3. Every single patch just keeps getting better and better. Genshin always delivers that good stuff inside us. Wait, what? Barbara's voice line got changed. Let the show begin. Oh, Let yeah. Let the show begin. No, 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 no. We can do it. Come on. We can do it. Barbara. She sounds so What's depressed. Barbara is here. <sighs> All the standing around is making me so sleepy. Are you oh, tired? No. Try my new spicy energy drink. What the hell? I don't want to see you hurt. Don't worry about me. Da, 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 da. <laughs> Genshin was my favorite game, and you did this? How Look at the you? traveler's face. He's <clears throat> crying. Kaching, let's get out of here. Fuck you. I'm going to be downloading this game on my three other devices to play the upcoming Windbloom Festival. Unlock Venti <laughs> and explore the world of Teyvat. Nice. Someone please help. <laughs> Version 1.4. It's a little embarrassing to say, but... This patch had one of the most surprising <laughs> trailers when it started off showing the Windbloom Festival, and I was like, yeah, this is pretty cute. Oh. Then I saw this, and I was like, what? Seeing yep. all this made what's coming even more worth it, and I'm not even talking Rosaria. It was when you thought it was just a silly little festival with mini games, then they hit you with the most kill shit thing oh, you ever hell seen. yeah, dude. Oh, this is fucking lit. And that's when I knew this patch was gonna be a banger. You warm yeah. up in Kovacs, I warm up in Bullseye Balloon. We are not the same. Gliding events, classic. Ballad of Breeze was the first rhythm event, although you could only play four songs. The best part about this was the wind song Liar. The moment mm. people started getting oh, it, true. holy shit were people going crazy. Yeah, this bet. guy playing on a... What was that? ...started getting it, holy shit were people going... Was that... Hold on. I can't go back slightly. Wait. <laughs> That's a liar. It looks like someone's sticking pins into someone's thingy. 
I'm going crazy. I don't like this it. This guy playing on a keyboard? River this guy's you? playing on a keyboard! This guy's playing on a keyboard! Sick. This guy's keyboard plays itself! What? This guy's <laughs> editing the keyboard! How many games can you play Sans Undertale? How many games? These professionals are starting it's pretty to sick. piss me off. To you, happy birthday to you. We also oh. got mini games in mini games. These events were a little silly. Mom, can we have Fall Guys? Son, we uh, already have Fall, fall Guys, guys at home. home. <laughs> we have Fall Guys at home. Genshin Impact <laughs> Fall Guys type mini game should be permanent. Listen, guys, there's a lot of things that should be permanent. Could they don't end up being end game engagement. Yeah, you walk past five bubbles. <laughs> the end game is definitely gonna go crazy on this one. Hey, well, what's this guy doing <laughs> cheating in one of the modes? Hey, you can't do that. Mods, if we could perhaps kill this guy real quick, that would be much appreciated. The devs were really yaffing out these little schleppers. Poof head. So what else huh? did Windbloom have? Kaya. Kaya nice. is the type of guy to pick the urinal next to somebody. That guy's a freak. <laughs> If there's ah! anything bothering you, there's... <laughs> I don't, I don't like piss sounds. Not that loud, anyway. <laughs> you serious? I, I, I received a letter. Oh, Is it your Hogwarts it invitation says, letter? It says. Someone sent Barbara a death threat. Dear oh. Barbara, I've stolen the thing most precious to you and buried it. Holy shit. My sister. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I can deal with the voice lines. Killing her family? <laughs> After investigating the letter, we found out that it was someone's way to get Barbara's attention. <laughs> what kind of fucked up way is that? Very fucked up. Wait, did she actually think it was Jean or was that edited? That's hilarious. So sorry to get your attention this way. Let's be honest here. Wait, she did? It was you. Ow. She actually thought it was Jean? Oh, that's so fucked up. It was that idiot as well, right? From her hangout. Albert. Albert. Is, it, is, is it Albert? Albert. You Albert. might remember this guy as Barbara's number one simp. Well, yeah. now he's back in the festival. What a Come dick. on, guys. Albert gets a bad rap. He gets clowned on a lot, but what's so bad about being outside the location of one of your favorite <laughs> idols? Always watching. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh no. Oh no. What is this? I'm just such a huge fan of Mondstadt's idol, Barbara Sama. You must have heard of her. She's the super key one at the Church of Favonius. Not to mention gentle. Oh, I'm no. the head of the Barbara fan club. Huh. Uh... Pretty pleased about it too, by the sound of things. Yeah. So you talk to this dude in the festival, and he's like, yeah, I'm thinking of building a big-ass statue for the one and only Barbara. So, a statue. This giant statue will be about two stories high. Paimon then calls him a dunderhead. A level-headed adult? <laughs> More like a dunderheaded infant. <sighs> but Christ. gifts have to make a lasting impression. I agree. Trauma definitely has a long-lasting impact. Albert might be one of the most hated NPCs in Monsat, but if you stop and think... Uh-huh. How many fucking Alberts do we have in this community? Hey guys, it's me, Nimrod. Who's Nimrod? I'm afraid I'm a bit. I would hope not many. There's people that simp over 2D fake characters, but I wouldn't say real people are going to fucking do fucked up shit, right? Please? I'm a drunkard. I'm nearly always in the tavern. My wife hates me drinking, <laughs> so we're constantly arguing. Don't drink then. Another day? Or oh, just don't drink as much. Uh oh, what's that? Bennett is Celestia. in prison for the murder of five kids in a pizzeria? Lock him up. Amber, the gliding champion, almost crashing into Noelle and killing her. Hey, huh? my man, Timaeus. Hey, who let these two criminals out? We can collectively agree that Monsat is the homiest region. That's why there's no straight people. Free four star weapon. Free four star weapon. Look it up. No. What? I don't think I've... Our weapon. 
free four star. I don't think I've ever seen that weapon. Star weapon. Look it up. Windbloom O. No, Fisho isn't getting kidnapped. It was nice to see Mihoyo learn from their mistakes. That is the first lantern right. And for that, Windbloom gets a festival out of 10. Nice. Aside from your typical run of the mill kill monster event and marvelous merchandise, did I tell you that you can become Pokemon? Tell me this isn't the best event ever created. We need more events like this. I know I just said Pokemon Genshin Impact, but I hate huh? Pokemon. This event had a what? pretty cool idea of taking a boss and making it into an event. I it's love like Pokemon. farming them in the overworld, except you get more rewards and the gameplay actually feels like but you're I wish fighting I was around for this. I remember the first time I played an Ocean it was I hate Oceanid. She just does so much damage with her goons and that shitty bubble explosion. What's my favorite Pokemon? Lugia. The frogs. I like Lugia. Why don't we I just, just like Pokemon every frog from existence? Oceanid nowadays, you should really call her Snorshinid. It's the most boring ass thing ever. Oceanid True. in this event was like. Ah! What the fuck is oh my god! The last time I felt any sense of challenge or danger when doing world bosses was 1987. Oh, was that no. the, when Bennett bit that the, the frontal of lobe off that kid. 87? These bosses are just chores. That's the whole point. You just farm them and forget about it. But the Ocean It event made her interesting to fight. And I think that every now and then, it's a good event to have instead yeah, of the same potato enemy like dungeon that. fight with buffs. You get this Endora pet. She doesn't disappear when you go swimming, unlike this pee pee I want the pet. And for that, Endora gets the Fontaine stamp of approval. True. I'll be checking in to see if she's fireproof when we eventually start diving into volcanoes for Natlin. Probably we not. We reunited was a huge lore dump that oh, dragged you straight yeah. back into the whole reason the traveler's here in the first place. Where's the pizza? The festivals were cute, but now we're getting serious. Uh -huh. I will do a very light spoiler. I promise it's nothing. You meet Lumine in the quest. Ooh. I think yeah. it's universally agreed that the traveler being silent 99% of the time suck ass. Yep. I can live with it, but at least make him speak his shit when it's arguably one of the most important moments. He does. He goes, Lumine! Means like being reunited with your sister who got kidnapped and put Lumine. in a box? See? He did it then. <laughs> Lumine! Aether. <laughs> That's all he fucking says. It's like a Pokemon. Sign language. Aether, why are you with Dane? I can't fucking speak, Lubid. Can we God let Zach speak. eat? He's getting breadcrumbs every three patches because he says one sentence. Like, imagine if this happened. It's the end. You conquered all seven Thank nations. You that Sacrifice everything. Dane sleep gets naked. The heavens are pissed, and it cuts to you, standing before your sister, reunited once more, what the fuck only is that to edit? have a fucking staring contest. How many times am I gonna have to explain this to you, you fucking piece of shit? Just make oh, sure no. your account can actually do damage, because if not, be prepared to spend more time fighting these stupid ass ruin guards than reading the story. Condensed resin cap increased to five. Wow, you can lower your world level. Whoa, they optimize Xiao expression Wait. when casting element. You couldn't lower your world level before this patch? Mental skill. This game just keeps on getting better and better. Well, I guess, I guess, um, I guess there wasn't that many world levels out at this point, right? Maybe? Or people hadn't gotten to a high world level yet? Travelers will also be able to restart the challenge mid-combat in the Abyss. Nice. It took them four oh my God, patches you to realize that? that having a retry button in the Abyss was a good thing. You get a secret achievement for changing the dialogue volume. I'm over here stroking my- Can you hear Paimon? Hey! Holy shit. It's back. Genshin's back. <laughs> Genshin motherfuckers with the death state three years to add a button that delete all map pins. And then they nerf Rosaria's chess. How is this playable? Is it really Genshin if I'm not coming? Coming. Like coming to the App Store to download Genshin Impact. Pull for Yula and fight against Shut the Asta High in a tense battle to save the traveler. Shut up, I thought she said Yulan. Yul Genshin was back. Now it's not. Rosaria got nerfed again. Wait. I tried the new one. I ain't gonna cap. I didn't. I thought they only nerfed her once, not from not in 2.4 as well as 1.4. Old outfit, and something fell off. So I started measuring, and this is the result. You measured. <laughs> this is exactly the leading edge of mathematics. 
that I come here for. Give back Rosaria her boobs. As the world is already going through a difficult time, Rosaria's nerf was found to be both unfair and saddening. She doesn't Can't give a shit. Players demand respectfully to give Sister Rosaria back her boobs. I don't want to be that guy. I don't think we're changing shit with dirty signatures. NPC no. 1.2 Rosaria had enough missiles to take out Conria. Oh my god. I have to end. Don't do it! Oh my god. Rosaria Jesus. feels like Genshin's punching bag for censorship laws. Look at this, your honor. We are doing our utmost best to ensure that our ladies are fully clothed. Because being naked is not professional. Oh my, Hoyoverse, you're doing such a good job. Keep it up. Well, what about Shenha too? Shenha hey, literally hey. got a fucking belly button removed of all things, dude. Bought it. You can Crazy bring it out to now. me. Come on, let's get out of here. Oh my god. <laughs> hey, hey, what are you doing with that lady over there? She's very inappropriately closed. Could you please patch her up? Oh. Don't worry, Your Honor. Leave the rest to us. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, fantastic. There it is. Excellent work. There it is. Because, you know, belly buttons are so hot and sexy. Psych! That's the wrong number! Stop! Stop it! Stop it! Stop! Oh, my God. Nice. Okay, this is going to be the skins, isn't it? <laughs> if you guys do not know how you guys can download Genshin Impact on your mobile, well, you guys are at the right video because I'm going to be showing you guys how you guys can do that exactly. Okay. So in mobile, it's only available for iOS. So if you guys are an Android user, you cannot play Genshin Impact. Wait. So first step, you want to click on App Store and open your That's App Store. That's a thing? Once you open your App Store, go on versus search. And at the top, you want to write Genshin Impact. G-E-N-S-H-I-N. I M P A C T. That's After not... you search for Genshin Impact like this, it's you... gonna be shown over here called Genshin Impact. But that's basically how we guys can. Good guide because it shows that if you spell it wrong, it still shows up. Download Genshin Impact. So hope you guys understand. If you guys did, then don't forget to hit the like and subscribe. No shot. That's an actual fucking tutorial. Listen, I don't fault the guy that made the tutorial. I, bro, if there's actually people out there that had to look up a fucking tutorial on how to go to the fucking app store and search for a video game. That's fucking wild. Wild. Oh god. If it is fated, we will meet again. One of the hypest trailers we've gotten so far. What is a turtle doing on my screen? <laughs> Ask the huh. It's one of those things where I spell his name different every time. This oh my god. Oh so my god. This is bad. Oh my oh god. goodness. Jungly. Jongli, I'm gonna need your help. Hey guys, look at my uh, teapot. Yenfei was the new four star on the chopping block after Rosaria's head got chopped off the block. And despite what many people what? tell you, she's not a lawyer, she's a legal advisor. Is that the same thing? I don't know. Maybe I should look it up. You usually don't want to pull for specific four stars because you're gonna hit pity or six Noels, but she was running with post buff Zhongli, so you could make a case oh, to pull for our four star legal advisor. Get it? Make a case. Yula, uh -huh. on the other hand, oh my goodness. Funny. She's one of the hottest characters, but I'm sorry to my fans who look up to me. No one that hot would make me play physical. <laughs> She's a physical carry. What am I gonna... Oh, no. God. I will not be coming. This was once part of a huh? ceremony for aristocrats to show off their status. Maybe I'll come. Chances are near zero. Near zero. Dude, what is this, zero. man? You can't just play a hot girl sneezing and expect me to put. You really ought to learn some proper etiquette. Bless you. No, no, no. Don't do it, aka shot. Remember when you moon gazed with me? Yula is a ho get this scoliosis head ass out of here. <laughs> you will never replace me. I'm number one. What the fuck? Number one. Number one. That was painful, dude. Who the fuck are you? Let's talk about this guy. Astaha? More like bullshit the huh? This guy was making me angry. He just had so many so stupid one hell. moves. Listen, oh. No! Crap! No shot, dude. Age the huh? is literally Satan. And I can prove it. Go okay. to the wiki and look at his scaling. 666. 
And you Damn. might be like, oh, it's just a one-time thing. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You think it's just a one-time thing? Coincidence? I think not. What the not. hell? He is Satan! Crazy. He's Satan! Terrifying. If you're struggling with Astaha, you need a healer. Hey, what's up, guys? Today, we're going to talk about healers. <laughs> so you might be inclined to ask, well, who's the best healer for Astaha? Not the Zhengling, dude. It's Zhongli! Age Daha. Well, yeah, it's C6. <laughs> Age Daha is not a boss fight. It's Zhongli propaganda. What? Oh, no. The community's initial reaction. How am I even supposed to do Ash Daha without Zhongli? Yes, this is a rage post because I don't see how somebody is supposed to do Ash Daha without Zhongli. Yes, hitbox is... Sorry, his hitboxes last unimaginably long, so even if you use both dodges, you still get hit. You need a good shielder, and the only shielder capable of actually tanking Ash Daha's hits is Zhongli. This is a guy that dodges outwards, so the shockwave hits him on the way out instead of dodging inwards to avoid the, uh... The, the, to iframe the actual original attack, isn't it? Finally got around to this boss, so garbage, unbelievable how bad it is, basically just have Zhongli the boss fight. If this is the direction they go with this game, I honestly want to quit skill issue. You should. Does anyone like the Ashtaha boss fight? Genuinely curious. Bro, the Ashtaha boss fight's fucking amazing, especially without shielders. Not reading all that. Happy for you though, well, really sad that happened. Yep, good one as well. Is Ashtaha too strong or am I just bad? He's gonna tell him. How do you beat Ajdaha? Use Zhong Li. Jesus Christ! A weekly boss that basically requires a whole new team out of you if you don't have the right units. I guess this is the real reason we get the first three bosses on discount every week. They knew they were releasing something people just wouldn't want to do. How the fuck do they have the silver thing in 20... Wait... What? Or is that edited over, I guess? I'm so confused. Oh yeah, I guess the screenshot was taken later, so the PFP was updated. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Wait. This fight is literally questioned. Do you have Zhongli? Yes, enjoy the fight, or no, go fuck yourself and die. This person literally has Bennett up here. Bro, you have Bennett. What? <laughs> I don't know, dude. That's that skill First issue. Time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I just how to response to these allegations. Little stupid ass, I don't give a fuck. I don't True. give a fuck. I don't, I, don't, I don't give a fuck, bitch. I don't give a fuck about you. We are literally entering Ashdaha's ass every time we fight him. If the crystal tree is equivalent to his tail, oh, multiple invulnerable phases, check. Dude. Long animations. You know, the worst thing about the Ashdaha boss fight for me is the multiple invulnerability phases and the fact that you, there's so much time doing fucking nothing or that you can do fucking nothing. I don't give a shit about the difficulty. It's the it's the invuln phases, dude. They're dog shit. I want to do more. If you could please hurry the fuck up, it would be greatly appreciated. True. You're holding everybody else up because you're an inconsiderate bastard. Check criminal hitboxes. You got it. Elemental resistance. Nice. The ley yeah. line disorder where he marks minorities without shields. I love it. This guy has the HP afford the ballins. He's also the first weekly boss where you go into his. Does he? For yeah, that yes. actually makes sense. <laughs> that adds up. It's time, Morax. We settle this now. Come. Hey, Staha. Shall we get going, you and I? Mm. More axe. Are you satisfied, Staha? I hate this guy with a passion when he came out, but you know what? He made rage beneath the mountains. He made rage beneath the mountains. You can do anything, King. You are forgiven. With the introduction of Teapot, you can now put Child in prison. That's all he's good for. Like there are it. people who main Teapot, Fortnite building some of the craziest shit. This is not Ashtahar? even Mondstadt. 
We had someone once, if Bob can even find the image, she can put it on screen. I, I might have been in one of the very old YouTube shorts, but there was a whole ass fucking Ashtahar in one of the teapots, dude. It was nuts. It's teapot. You can build farms, go to the pool. You can watch porn. It was crazy. It was Howie? It might have been. You can get married. True. Oh, you thought I was joking? Then you have me over here turning my house into a Bitcoin miner. <laughs> you know what else Teapot also has? Naked Raiden. Why what? didn't you look? There's no Naked Raiden in Genshin Teapot. Oh my goodness. Win Trace. This is the best Sick event. Sick event. I agree. I think I got Great like event. five best events. They kind of fucked it up last year though. It honestly didn't feel as good. I really hope they add some new stuff and make it a little bit more interesting because I do think doing the exact same thing every year is a bad idea, but they made it somehow worse last year, and I didn't think that was possible. I can't remember exactly what they did, but it wasn't as good. Events this video, but it's prop hunt. What's not to like? Let's this make was it one of that. the most fun events because I just spend the like whole time trolling and doing the dumbest shit. Don't mind same. me. I'm just a box in a tree. <laughs> It'd also be cool if sometimes they you could set it so that you could like randomize the the actual item placements so that it wasn't as easy to find you. Well, boys, we did it. We found our sister. What's the point of going through all these Archon quests when we have Lumine right here? She was playing hide and seek the whole time. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Oh, oh shit! God. That's a child kidnap. Uh oh. Don't do it. Fuck. And his best. <laughs> Partner in crime. I do love this I'm event, lamp. dude. I'm a lamp. I'm a lamp. Shh, shut up. Shut up. What did I say? We gotta lay low, or else our friends are gonna die. We oh gotta. Got it so loud. Sky. Five tips to succeed as a hunter in the Genshin Impact Wind Trace event. Number four. Find pay everybody. Pay attention to your surroundings. What? Energy amplifier was the new kid in town, except this new oh, kid yeah. got captured by aliens, probe, and cloned three times. Cause I'm seeing a pattern between events and collecting rocks. Not Fool wrong. me once, took my shoe. Fool me twice, have a bowl of rice. Fool me thrice, have this cat. You can what? get a free Diona in 1.5, and no, she didn't get kidnapped. She's not a kid. <laughs> She's a cat. Catnapped. There ain't no loss for cats. Does anyone know how to get Diona and Genshin Impact? I'm, I'm in, in PS4. PS4. Help! 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 How to get Diona YouTube video. <laughs> oh, sake, dude. Oh. So clever, so smart. Nice. Diona, she got the shield. How many views? I can't see. 257 likes though. I'd give it a thumbs up. They're not wrong. Diona, that is how to get Diona. She got the shield, heal, cleanse. Common sense dictates she's a support. True. So why does she ascend with cryo damage? Because she's bad. Why is this here? For is this for people who lost 50-50 to Ganyu? Yes. Santa, can we have Ganyu for Christmas? <laughs> <laughs> Misty Dungeon, you can play as Mona. Base Three years event. later, I still don't have Mona. Again, though, they fucked up the latest version of it, I feel like. I feel like the older Misty Dungeon was better. We actually had to, like, go through a dungeon. God, <laughs> oh, no. Mimi Tomo was our first racist of... <laughs> During this event... Huh? Players will have to track down an unusual hilly trill. The players will get some help from hilly trillian expert Ella Musk and her handy handbook of hilly trillian to communicate with other hilly trills to find whereabouts on the unusual hilly trill. So you basically conspire okay. with a little kid to target unusual hilly trills. Oh, it's fine to profile this hilly trill. Oh. Why? Because it's unusual. That's why. A unusual hilly trill has been spotted in Windrise. Oh Mods, kill his whole family. Jesus Christ. Hey. God. Why are hilly trills helping us? The non-usual ones. Wait, why are they helping? Isa. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Yo. I just killed this guy's <laughs> brother right in front of him. Oh, it's hungry. Ah, uh, uh, yes, the fate of my species rely on a fucking piece of fish. Now with this, I will tell you how to kill more of my kind. 
What if they don't like fish? What if they don't like fish? Telling all their business. You rock up to the location and the guy is bing chilling out the ass. He even brought his <laughs> anti-racist friends, but I'm sorry. You were sold for a piece of fish. Yeah. Huh? I'm only human after all. I'm only human after all. No one can on me. But does racism even exist when you are a hot anime girl? God damn. Yes. Look, at the, look at the way she moved. Listen, man. You can't just have two minutes of Yula dancing and have it be a good day. Oh. Now you can. I thought you said no one that hot would make you play physical. Well, ka -ching. It's a good thing she's cryo. <laughs> nice. I'm here every night Sunday. Put it in front of a live studio audience. But during all these shenanigans, Patch 1.5 started a change that evolved the hardcore experience forever. What? Festivals come and go, but now we got the Abyss Patch. Huh? There's a reason I didn't talk about the Abyss until now. What? Why? It was baby. Ruin guards. Mages, Fatui, Pyro, Agent. What kind of times were we living in where this was considered endgame? Now we have heroes well, like four and characters. lectors in the abyss. Oh, Get really? Get ready for the level 100 tag team double fisting session. Oh, that is, fuck that. You can even make it to floor 12. Floor 11 had this Jesus. slowing water debuff and you can't even dodge it. It made your cooldowns a hundred times longer. So they ever add that shit back into the fucking spiral abyss? I'm not doing that fucking spiral abyss. If you don't have a cleanser, your flight to Guangdong province is now ready. No. You no. ready to learn Chinese, buddy? <laughs> Absolutely fucking not. A hundred and twelve. <laughs> See, we just said good time to be a Tatalia main. Yeah. You don't fucking say. That's insane. That is wild. Oh, and you know what? We also have the Water Avengers! Yes, because we need more! Get the Avengers in here! Get the Avengers in here! Tony Stark, fuck me in the ass! We huh? went from Boing Boing Slime and Treasure Hunter Seaman to Inter- well, he's got skill issue though. This is why he was failing the abyss. Did you see what he just did? What kind of fucking rotation is that for a 1.x player? Did you see that shit, chat? Look. He went from Boing Boing Slime and Slime. He ulted with a Zhang Ling instead of using Guo with the highest damage dealer. Fucking stupid, dude. And also, that's not the physical damage weapon. I'm You're throwing. And treasure hunter, semen to intergalactic alien. Throwing. Back in the good old days, when everyone was a noob, trying to defend the monolith from a horde of hilly trolls without Venti changes a man. Yes. Yeah. It was fucked up. You without not shoot without me. any CC on that side, that is ridiculous. I guess maybe you've got Animal Traveler, but it's that's fucking not enough. Well, you piece of this was the beginning in a new era of endgame content, and it's crazy to see the evolution of Abyss. <laughs> Abyss in 1.2. <laughs> you piece of shit. Oh, oh my god, is that a world of this guy? What's it doing? Tell me I'm not inside Jurassic Park right now. How did a goddamn train get in here? True. They had dance floors in this game. I forgot about the Consecrated Beast Abyss. That might have been the worst abyss I've ever personally fucking tried. And I think I 36 started. it. It just took a while. It, it was just very bad. Very annoying. Yo, 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 hey, 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 hey. Are we even playing the same game? They got an alien. What is this? You're bringing out my worst enemy now. The chicken now? Come on. What the hell? Jesus Christ. That was also an annoying boss for the abyss. That and the Ruined Snake. Too much time underground, dude. Although I will say... That one, the animal one, I started to enjoy once I figured out how to actually do it. Hi, so I'm Saul Goodman. That bad. Did you know that you have rights? Constitution really? says you do. Interesting. And so do I. I believe that until people do, every man will be a The Golden Apple Archipelago <gasps> is a scam. Based. What? Fuck you. Actually, I don't know if you should fuck you, because I, I, the second one was really good. I never played the first one. The third one didn't exist. Instead, we got a fucking bottle. There was never a golden apple anywhere despite searching the entire ocean. The boats were introduced and it changed everything. When you explore the whole game on two legs, you start to appreciate non-leg transportation. We got a boat. 
Tell me, how many games have boats? You were like a grandma airship into some random ocean. What's going on? Wave riding all over your enemies, exploring caves, going to Brazil. There's a random rock in the middle of the ocean with a tennis court. The puzzles required 4D chess and balls. It was pretty fun to see that shit slap back and forth. And while they were pretty fun, they had this rock puzzle. I'm like Sisyphus, brute forcing the solution. Eventually, I'll hit the right order. I mean, maybe. Get the fuck I out of here, and too. you? What I will ask you, though, is... Can you give me one more day? I'm not asking you for a week. No. This guy one was so day, immersed, baby. he climbed on the wall, and instead of going up, he went back <laughs> down and climbed up the ladder. There was a secret <laughs> island pop right on the map. That's all no, that not secret. that one. This one. You have to oh. navigate through the fog. You can bomb hilly churl houses. No! Nice. Don't take me back. There was a locked chest. You had to open it with a code. Two. Yeah, I'm Googling that shit. Look two. at this puzzle right here. Look at it. Was it two? What? Look at this. I don't like these child favoritism puzzles. It's a good thing he's <laughs> locked up in teapot prison. The whole True. island was screenshot material. To be honest, the whole game is screenshot material. When it comes to music, I truly believe that a good-ass soundtrack elevates the gaming experience. You I can agree. have a piece of steak, but if there's no seasoning, it's gonna be bland. Music seasons the game. We're gonna get a little bit more on there. Soul? Is that... I have fond memories of Dragon Spine and Golden Apple because of their beeps and boops. While playing through the map, uh, the you would best listen kind to of shit white like seasoning. this. Salt and pepper. Just salt and pepper, baby. Oh, it's Asma's $2 steak. You oh, stop God. and wonder. This game has been out for three years. What have I done in the last three years? And it's the nostalgic tunes giving me these thoughts that makes me appreciate the OST in this game. Because looking back, the first archipelago in 1.6, there wasn't really a lot. But like Dragon Spine, it's a fun little pit stop that makes you feel like the golden apple. Except this scam ass place, never once did I see a golden apple. Unlocking the archipelago the breaks my heart to see Lumine fall and break all the bones in her legs. Oh the main God. gist of the story can be summarized like this. Ah uh, yes, that. I should start with how we ended up here. And how I met your mother. We arrived by dragon, but as soon as we entered the island's vicinity, something caught Razor's eye. He jumped straight off of the dragon's back and vanished into the ocean. What a fucking idiot. No shot, did. We yeah. worried that he'd be in danger, so we also leapt off the dragon. Time for <laughs> retribution. Hey, retribution. don't die on me, bulls. We got our first skin in the game. Barbara has a duck. Jean looks real dapper in the intro. I'm honestly surprised Hoyoverse hasn't milked the shit out of skins, because if you think about it, we have so much. I am incredibly surprised there is not more skins in this game, by the way. I do want to fucking put that out there. I'm incredibly surprised. Uh, I think there is endless potential when it comes to skins, and I think people would buy them. And they make for a permanent, like, constant way to, for people to buy them. I don't know. Official art of characters in different outfits, and when you consider the amount of Alberts that play this game... <laughs> oh, God. I think that Barbara skin sucks, by Hoyo the way. Don't, why are don't you hate ignoring me. this free money glitch? They have to be saving skins as a trump card. Ah, shit! Revenue has been going down. The players are leaving. What are we gonna do? Hmm. Let me see from my years <laughs> of business. Okay. Gotcha. Yo! Ads. Why don't we just release Naked Raiden skin? We're rich, baby! But what? my immersion skins are gonna ruin everything! And while I don't want LeBron James Fortnite... <laughs> Super TF. At some point, nice. we have to consider, is it worth breaking the canon timeline to have Kazuha and Beidou dripped out in front of a car? Fuck yes! Bro! Uh... If you go to take on a fucking enemy in that land, you're not going to be walking around there with a fucking rubber duck as Barbara, are you? Yes, it's fucking worth it. That's the answer. Anything else is wrong. You're telling me 
You don't want Ayaka in a kimono, Faruzan coffee, school outfits, sportswear Bennett, KFC Noel Diluc, Pizza Amber Yula, Scientist Tignari Kole, Boba Ganyu Shenha, Boba Kamisato, Three Hu Taos, Convenience Store Yoimiya, Pizza China, Tukin, Marriage, Pizza Jean? Come on, you don't want Pizza Jean? We also got a new world boss in 1.6. The Magu Kenki. Compared to the other world bosses at the time, he was different. I'm the guy! I am a yeah. noble elemental life form that dwells within bodies of pure water. I am born from a draconic calamity. I I'm made by Raiden. Uh, I really like Magu Kenki. I reached the highest level of elemental purity. I was imbued with the essence of biting frost. I'm a puppy! I take 10, ten seconds, seconds to stand up. True. Magu Kenki. Could this be Shao Senpai? No. Yeah, that looks about right. Magu Kenki photo shoot. <laughs> Cool. Was this part of the event one? Yeah, it is, isn't it? I gotta admit, I was at least half chub watching his introduction. What? Why is this guy so cool? Why is this guy eating a leaf? Kazuha, to me, is a character that you don't really know you need until you press skill into burst, and then you're like, yeah, this guy has the most satisfying gameplay. He's versatile, can group enemies, smooth animation, stamina reduction, empowers He's definitely the team. satisfying. kind of chill like that. Everything Kazuha does makes your life more fun. He does True. a little bit of everything, and he also gives a little bit of everything. He don't be healing unless you put the black sword on him. You don't need him, but after using him, you can't go back. Kazuha is the salt of Genshin, and his demo? Hey, watch out, what the you had this Ina Zoom in Exile kicking ass and the Bro, music went For some reason, Kazu, don't hate me for this chat, but I think you might understand. Kazu's demo's really forgettable for me. <laughs> but I think it's because or is it the teaser? I always get confused between the demo and the teaser, because I feel like one is by far better than the other, or the music in one. I, I feel like the music in the teaser is by far better than the other one. I can't remember. Which is isn't the teaser way better than the fucking demo? Am I not correct with that? Teaser was better? Yeah, right? The teaser was far better than the character demo itself, I feel like. So hard even yeah. his enemies started breakdancing. Like so it might surprise you to see that teaser I skipped sick. him. And this is a problem I have with Genshin in general. When you put my queen Ayaka the patch after Kazuha, how can I play? I want to pull for every yeah. character, but I can't unless I spend money. I would've give you the money. You would not give me shit. You fucking know. I would've give you the money. You're lying. Wait. <laughs> That's how gotcha games make money! What kind of sick business move is this, miHoYo? You're gonna expect me to sit there and skip the soul. I have no choice. It's blasphemous. Blasphemous? Damn. Like the Klee banner running along Kazuha, except this time she's had enough. <laughs> no, not the oh my god, what the fuck? We got a free four-star weapon, uh, Dodoko Tails. I want that! Look at it. It got me thinking. Festering Desire, Windbloom Ode, Dodoko Tails. How do you get these if you miss the event? You're done. Well, lucky for you, they have a system that lets you oh replay my. past events. Thank you, Hoyoverse. Download the game today and play as Dunhung from Genshin Impact. Aside from that, the rest of the patch was Kaboom Ball and killing bosses in Vagabond. Midsummer Island Adventure felt as if Genshin- You should add a disclaimer that you're fucking kidding, Muji, for the people that-, that I was gonna say Muji. oh my god. Us. Bro, I can show Muji give it the same kind of vibes, but Muji is far more unhinged. Far more unhinged. Summer update. Let's relax and talk about that one time everyone thought Ulfur was a pedophile back when the game came out. What? Let's relax and talk about that one time everyone thought Ulfur was a pedophile. Back when the game came out, there was this dude outside Monsat standing next to a river. So you talk to him and find out he's building a boat for this fl Oh, the Flora incident. Uh-oh. Flora girl, so light and dainty. One day. Day. I will confess my love to Flora on board a dandelion boat. They really it's should have made sure that my last few attempts have all sunk on their maiden voyages. Then he gives you five crabs, and honestly, that's pretty sweet of him to keep working on his boat for this girl he likes. And then you're like, wait, Flora, isn't she that 10 year old? <laughs> they really should have made sure about this before, you know.
anything. That sells flowers? What the fuck? This guy just At tried all. to bribe me with five crabs. <laughs> I'm sure even Mr. Krabs does not approve of this. But then I Mademoiselle found out Crabaletta that this would was not all be a happy. setup. Ulf R has to be the most sabotage NPC yep. in Genshin history. I found out that Flora was never actually a kid. She when wasn't did supposed she look to like be. like this? So I did a little bit of investigation, might say so myself, and I found out that this Flora was Beta Flora. Yeah. And for some reason, when the yeah. game came out, Mihoyo turned her into a kid. But did and they never shit. changed his voice lines. So they forgore. Damn. Damn. Police. Bitch. Poor character, dude. It is a very big one. Put yourself in his shoes. The last time you saw Flora, she was taller than the Traveler. Everyone is calling you out for being a pedo, and what can you do except stand there because you were programmed to confess to your lover who got turned into a 10 year old by your creators and they never changed Jesus. your dialogue to compensate? The twists and turns in this story is enough to be its own movie. But Mihoyo? Uh huh. They remember. They finally remember. They changed his dialogue about Flora, so now it's a cute little family story. They ain't believing us. God did. 1.0, we're kidnapping what kids to confess to them in the middle of the ocean. Now we're taking our little sister on a boat ride. Let's <laughs> go. I'm going to answer the question that we've all been having on our minds since you've been watching this video. God did. How does Wait, it God all did come what? back to Klee? ka -ching, bring out the lobster. Tell him to bring out the lobster. ka -ching? I don't like oh, no. you anymore. You a simp. I'm going to be catching you later. Damn, get rolled. When Genshin was released, who was there at the beginning? Klee. True. When version 1 ended, who had a rerun? Klee. Klee. Coincidence? Well, actually, yes, but then I saw version 2 and 3, both ending with Klee banners, and it was then yeah. I realized Cause it's a that- No, she's not an Avenger, it's the fucking Golden Apple Archipelago. Klee is Genshin's true end game. Version 4 is also gonna end with Klee. And Probably. And the game's final version is also gonna have Klee in it as well. Probably, because the game's final version will finally probably show us Alice. Oh. The Klee fan theory that has Genshin Impact players talking. Klee's appearance might have to do with her mother. What a fucking goated theory, dude. Child may look like her biological mother. Oh my fucking god. Oh shit. Damn, dude. Who would have thought? W A I T. W A I T. W. Wait. <laughs> Expose the truth? No. What? About her looking like a mom? What the fuck? Doki Doki. Kaching. What? If Alice is Klee's mom, yeah. that means that Klee is Alice's daughter. Well According done. to this logic, that must also mean that Jean is Barbara's sister. This also means that 1.6 is called the Midsummer Island Adventure. Yeah. Wait a minute. What? Midsummer Island. Adventure. Yeah. M. I. I. E. Missing in action. The golden apple has been missing in action no, for the whole version. No. Or is it? Hey, no. Vsauce. My version 1.6 was released on June 9, 2021. Uh -huh. 0 06 09 2021. Add the numbers. And you get 2036. In 2036, in Genshin Impact 2 Electric Boogaloo, we're going to get the Golden Apple Archipelago with an actual Golden Apple that we can take home as a, as a piece of furniture for the teapot. 1.6. Oh. 16. Hello. 2036 minus 16 equals 2020. Genshin Impact was released in 2020. It What's also the point? has 11 letters. You know what else has 11 letters? Golden. 
letters? I had to check. <laughs> you know what else has 11 letters? Golden apple. 11. Archipelago. 11. If the golden apple is 11 letters and the archipelago is 11 letters, according to this equation, the golden apple is the archipelago. Archipelago are known as a group of islands. Yeah. Islands. HMM. HMM. Apple. Islands. Yeah. Oh, it was so obvious. Signaling, 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 signaling. Central control. Can you hear? Yes, kicking. What is it you want? Kicking. This is an emergency. An emergency city. Central control. Please bring up the archipelago. What okay. the fuck? Initializing sequence boat. Bringing up the archipelago. <laughs> Stop. Enhance. Enhancing onto golden apple archipelago. Uh huh. What? Oh my god. My god. Come on now, you got to be kidding me. You got to be kidding me. Audible gas. The golden apple was there Holy the whole shit. time. <laughs> it it wasn't a scam? No. Wait, that's it. <laughs> that's how you end it? I just what the fuck is wrong with you? That was a fantastic video. A fantastic video. But what the fuck? And now he can do Genshin's second impact, Genshin's third impact, Genshin's fourth, it, you know? All of these, dude. All of them. It'll be great.